I think I'm already one of these, and I'm definitely not a manly woman. I am definitely a bit of a womanly man. Well, hello, everybody. My name it's Mark Bob, and welcome back to Would You Rather. Um, I quite like the idea of this game. Uh, I'm going to call it a game. Um, it's kind of cool to. It's kind of a different thing to what I usually do, but it kind of does really make you think. So, uh, let's get back on with it. Would you rather know how to speak only English? That's all I can do anyway. Or know how to speak every language, language, but never English. Um, well, isn't the most common language in the world English anyway? So you'd be a bit screwed if you didn't know how to speak English. So I'm going to just speak to English. Really? People would rather speak like every other language. English is like, I'm sure it's like the world language or something. It's like the most popular or I don't even freaking know. If you could only save lives through two ways, would you rather prevent World War II and all the war related deaths that went along with it uh, or cure all forms of cancer and STDs? I would cure all forms of cancer because cancer is horrible. Um, so, uh, yeah, because the war kind of, it is what it, it was. Um... But I mean that's gone and that's that's gone now. But um, can curing cancer that's a lot that's a lot cooler. Uh, and yeah, there we go, eight four percent. Good choice, people. Good choice. If you travelled to England recently, would you rather wait? I'm already in England. Uh, would you rather attend the royal wedding or attend the Olympic games? Well, the royal wedding is boring. Uh, all that I know was I got a day off for it for reasons I don't even know. Um, so I'd much rather go to the Olympics. That's a lot cooler. There you go. Big old 74%. Would you rather have an all expenses paid two month vacation in France? Pretty cool. Or be on the moon for an hour? Um, see, the cost of an all expenses paid two month holiday in France is probably cheaper than being on the moon for an hour. And the experience is, I can go to France whenever I want. Like, France is like only like, probably like a couple of hours, like an hour on a plane. So, uh, I being on the moon would be pretty sick. So, I'm gonna go on the moon. Hey, oh what, 50-50? I thought that was gonna be a lot higher. Fuck that shit. Would you rather <coughs> be deaf and have no legs? What? What? Or be blind and have no arms? Um. Oh, that's hard. Really? So I won't be able to hear anything or experience anything like music or TV uh, through my, obviously through my ears, not watching TV, uh, and have no legs or be blind and have no arms. I feel like arms are a bit more useful than legs. So I'd rather be deaf and still be able to see because I can't imagine not being able to see. That would be weird. Um, so I'm going to go for that one. Yeah, there you go. A lot more people agreed with me. I didn't think it. I thought it was going to be close to 50-50, but hey ho. Would you rather be born with red hair or have one hundred dollars stolen? What's so wrong with red hair? Jesus Christ! What? I don't know what the problem is with having red hair, but then also have a hundred dollars stolen from me is not a big deal. Um, but I'm gonna sound like I'm so offensive to gingers, but I'd rather just have a hundred dollars stolen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Really? That was pretty well to be fair. I mean, oh wait, I'm backing up on what I've I'm, I'm backtracking now, but really really um, I should have chosen the blue one. <laughs> I'm sorry gingers Would you rather have to use a completely blank keyboard with absolutely no labeled keys or have to type with only your two index fingers all the time? That would take forever. But also, if you had no labels on them, you wouldn't know what you were pressing. Um, I mean, I would have a, a big issue with that. I I, do you know what? I'm just going to say only type with two fingers. I don't know. Screw it. Oh, what? Really? Would you rather meet Chuck Norris or meet the old spot man? Chuck Norris! Yeah! 60% said Chuck Norris. Who? That is a no-brainer. Absolute no-brainer. Chuck Norris for the win. You're the best Nothing's gonna ever keep you down. Would you rather be near death or hear everything two minutes later? I would just rather hear everything two minutes later. Because that's not the end of the world. That's not the worst thing in the world. But being nearly deaf means you can hear bugger all anyway. At least if you hear things two minutes later, your, your hearing is still... I don't... 
you know what? I don't quite know my reasoning behind it, but I'm gonna hear everything two minutes later. What? Are you serious? Being near death, you're gonna be like, what? Say that again. I don't quite hear you. Come on, and again, love. Say it again, love. Say it again. I can't bloody hear because I'm near death. <coughs> Would you rather live to be 120 and accomplish nothing notable, or live to be 50 and be well known for the world change? Surely. I'd live to a 50 because after about 70, even 60 maybe, there's pretty much bugger all you can do anyway with your, with your time. So I'm going to go for that one. There you go. 79% to 21. Uh, would you rather be the world be full of atheists <laughs> or there be a world full of Christians? Uh, I think it might be better with atheists. But a world full of Christians, I'm not saying there's a problem with that, but there could be a lot of preachy Christians within those Christians. So I'm gonna say atheists. I know I'm probably gonna be outnumbered by this. Oh wait, there he is! Everyone agreed with me. Good on you. There is no bloody God. There is no God. <laughs> Would you rather live as a black man in the 1800s? Whoa, racism alert, racism alert. Or live as a woman in Afghanistan in present time. Where are you going to live as a black man? I mean, because I imagine certain areas of the world weren't as bad as uh, as others in the 1800s. So, ah, live as a black man. Yeah, there we go. 65%. That's such a ray, like a controversial one to ask, though. Uh, would you rather be credited with the intention of the wheel, or be credited with the invention of the internet? Of the internet. That in itself is probably going to get me laid. There we go, 86 bloody percent. Would you rather absolutely reek of armpits for the rest of your life or lose your sense of smell completely? Um, well, me reeking of armpits for the rest of my life, I'm not, other people are going to smell that. But if I lose my sense of smell, at least I'm personally going to smell great and people aren't going to walk like five foot behind me because I smell like ass. So I'm just going to lose my sense of smell, I don't care. Yeah, I don't care. Good choice, people. Good choice. And lastly, would you rather be a manly woman or a womanly man? Well, I think I'm already one of these. And I'm definitely not a manly woman. I am definitely a bit of a womanly man. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to be a womanly man. I'll take it. There we go. There's nothing wrong with that feminine star coming out every so often. <coughs> Anyways, I'm going to end that video there. If you did enjoy this video, then you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up. And let me know in the comment section below if you want to see another episode of this. Other than that, I want to thank you beautiful people ever so much for watching. You're beautiful. Don't let anyone ever tell you any different. You're goddamn beautiful. Anyways, take care. Bye-bye. So, motor functions, that's like, I think that's like moving and... And handy things and I don't fucking know. <laughs>